Hi, welcome to BS Paranormal's uh, Paranormal Review. This is uh, Scott, and I'm here to uh, give you some insight into what I think uh, the paranormal videos on YouTube have to offer, whether it's real or whether they're BS. So um, today I'm going to be doing one short video. It's about two minutes long from uh, video beginning to end. And uh, I'll give you my thoughts at the end of it. So uh, here we go. How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some scary ghost photos that seem to have no rational explanation. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more freaky content. Just like this. I'll put the link in the In September of 2018, two-year-old Fabiola Rodriguez was tragically killed. Her mother, Sandra Gonzalez, along with other loved ones, regularly leave toys and other items on the beloved child's grave. Sandra was disturbed when the items that she left for her late daughter began disappearing. She also noticed other acts of vandalism at the gravesite. She asked staff at the cemetery to keep their eyes open for anyone paying unwarranted attention to her daughter's grave. Luckily for the family, a nearby gravestone has a camera trained on it. This family has also experienced vandalism in the cemetery. They believe that their son's killer, who is still at large, is responsible for the cruel acts. They set up the camera in hopes of gaining evidence to take to the police. However, what they actually saw in the security footage was truly shocking. Images of a young girl appear in the still footage, walking near their son's grave. Concerned about a child wandering the cemetery at night, they showed the pictures to the staff, who immediately recognised the child as Faviola. Sandra, who happened to be at the cemetery that day, tearfully confirmed that it is her daughter in the photos. In one of the still images, Sandra believes that it shows her daughter walking away with a tall man, who the other family believes to be their son. Sandra is convinced that her daughter came back to the cemetery to lead the man to heaven. Because both suffered tragedy so early in their young lives, the families think that the kindred spirits have been drawn to each other in the afterlife, as evidenced by the footage from the cameras. Okay. So, we're expected to believe that A, the story is true, B, that um, even if the story has some truth to it, that that very solid image of the little girl is a ghost. Okay. So, um, I'm not immediately going to go down the I am a complete emotionless hat with this, and I am going to uh, assume that the story, at least in this scenario, the story of the family experiencing a loss and that the family um, was interviewed by the people working at the uh, gravesite, all that has truth to it. And so with that scenario, the employees at the cemetery got a little girl to stand out there, they took a picture, and then manipulated the emotions of the family and lied about the whole story. So in that case, the photo is still fake, but the story surrounding it has truth to it. In the other scenario, everything is just a lie. The story was completely made up. Someone went out and they um, got a little girl to stand in front of the cemetery. They took an IR picture of her, and then they developed this whole uh, mythos about it to, um, you know, get clicks, start views, all that fun stuff. So, is it real or is it BS? I definitely buy into this being BS. But you tell us what you think. Do you think that I'm being absurd and that there this could be a real image of a ghost? Or do you think I'm, you know, right and that there is very little to no truth in this? Please leave your comments below. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so you can get notifications when we post more of these. And see you next time.